I got this new area with this rather small closet and everything in here was kind of a mess. Everything was on the floor, bumped in the corner. And so I just started uh, trying to clean up everything, get everything off the floor. My theory is nothing goes on the floor unless it has wheels. So you can see I've got some, some screws up here to hold some things up here. Just put that in the wood. Um, I have these hooks up here, so I put a screw in there to get the uh, mop handle, which is a little bit too long for these other ones. Stuck the ladder, which was against this wall, and just stuck it up there on the hook so it's off the floor. I found this thing in another room downstairs and mounted that on the wall so that I'd have a place for these other implements that don't have holes on the top. So I got my desk mop, a tennis ball, which we use for black marks, and a scrubby thing. And then we had a mop too that needed to be hung up, but I just keep that in the mop bucket here, which fits right here next to the sink. The sink has been cleaned. It turns out that the sink is white, not spotted brown. Uh, these walls were absolutely filthy, so I went through, cleaned these entirely off with uh, with a scrubber, and uh, they are yellow, not brown, which is what they were before. So everything has a home right now. Uh, cleaned up the shelf up here a bit. There was some just some extra stuff up there that ended up uh, piling up up there because nobody knew what was there. So some of that got moved to other places where it was needed. And now I have room to put my stuff. Uh, you can see some of that. I just had a jar of screws there that I brought from home, and that's what I used for this. And this this one here, which is our scraper, this is actually a, an IKEA shelf thing that I just stuck in the wall and actually works really good for this. These are the extra blades for this and then this thing fits on there just fine. This hole is actually too small for a screw so I'm glad I had one of those extra and that fit in there nice. And then the uh, barrel fits in here. Just pull that out. The only thing on the floor is the mop bucket and then I had this this bucket was in here so I use that as a for microfiber. See, I can build up the microfiber over the week and I can just take that down one time a week. Instead of having to take that down all the time because the microfiber is in a different place than the trash. So I have to walk out of my way every day and then put my barrel. There are four kinds of liners that I have to use in this area. So you can see, I've got four liners right there in an X pattern and in here. You can see the tongs are on this side and those are the small uh, liners. So opposite the small liners are the medium sized liners, which from the outside they look the same. And I can just tuck those under the handles and keep those out of the way. And then I got these big ones and next biggest size. And you can see the big ones are wider than these so I can tell these apart. So as long as I know, as long as I can tell the difference between the small ones and the medium ones by keeping the tongs there. It's really easy to find the bags. I don't have to search for them. I always have the bags that I need and nothing more.